this is the part 5 of this uh, video tutorial on how to make this square uh, pineapple tablecloth or pineapple doily and this is the final part so uh, hope you will enjoy this uh, fifth part of the video to end around 47 we will slip stitch into the third into the third chain and we'll start round number 48 we'll slip stitch into the next double crochet and into the chain to space we'll do our beginning shell chain one and shell into the next shell <coughs> chain four and we will work our way across our pineapple so single crochet into the first chain three loop chain 3 and single crochet into the next and so on chain 3 and single crochet into the last chain 3 loop in this round 48 we will have 13 chain 3 loops in our pineapple chain 4 shell over and a shell chain 1, shell into the next shell chain 4 single crochet into the first chain 3 loop of our pineapple, chain 3, single crochet into the next and so on so work across this pineapple chain 3, single crochet into the last chain 1, chain 3 loop here we'll chain 1 and into the corner shell we will do a shell chain one and one more shell into the same space chain 1 and single crochet into the first chain 3 loop over pineapple chain 3 single crochet into the next and again work across this pineapple and we will have 13 chain 3 loops chain 3 and single crochet into the last chain 3 loop I will chain four we'll do a shell over a shell chain one and shell over the next shell chain 4 again and single crochet into the first chain 3 loop of our next pineapple chain 3 single crochet into the next and so on you will repeat this pattern 
and this is the uh, last uh, round uh, round number 48 I will meet you at the end of this round and then we will start to work in our pineapples each one uh, we will finish it and then we will go to the next and so on so complete this round and I'll meet you at the end of the round 48 that will start with round with our first pineapple and work um, across it and finish it okay slip stitch into the third chain For the next round, uh, for the uh, start of this uh, and work across this pineapple, we have to slip stitch into the next uh, shell. So, we will slip stitch into the next double crochet into the each of the next two chains okay. and into the next two double crochets okay now we'll slip stitch into the next uh, chain one space next two double crochets and into the chain 2 space ok we will do a shell chain 4 and single crochet into the first chain 3 space uh, chain 3 loop of our pineapple and we will work across this pineapple with a single crochet in every chain 3 loop and chain 3 between so now we will work uh, in each uh, pineapple and finish it and then we will go to the next one single crochet into the last chain 3 spin loop chain 4 and shell over the next shell So we did a shell, work across our pineapple and chain 4 and shell over a shell. Now we will chain 5, 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5 and we will turn our work around. And we will do a shell over a shell. So we had this chain 5 and then we turned around our work and we did a shell in a shell. Chain 4 and single crochet into the first chain 3 loop of our pineapple. Chain 3 and single crochet into the next and again work uh, throughout this uh, pineapple 
as we did uh, before single crochet in every chain 3 loop and chain 3 between and with each row we have one chain 3 loop less in our pineapple chain 4 and shell over a shell again chain 5 3 4 and 5 and turn our work around we'll do a shell over a shell chain 4 and single crochet into the first chain 3 loop of our pineapple chain 3 and single crochet into the next chain 3 uh, now you will repeat this uh, pattern until you will have only one chain 3 loop in our pineapple so you do a shell in every shell uh, here you do a chain 4 and then work across pineapple chain 4 shell over a shell and then chain 5 and turn your work and go back the shell over a shell chain 5 turn your work again shell over a shell chain 4 and work across pineapple and repeat this until you have only one chain 3 loop and then I will meet you there and show you how to finish off and start a new pineapple chain 4 so here we have our last loop, now we chain 4, we'll do a shell over a shell, chain 5, 3, 4 and 5, we will turn our work around and we'll do a a shell over a shell yeah. into the chain 3 loop we'll do a treble crochet and a shell over a next shell So we have a shell over a shell, treble crochet into the chain 3 loop, a shell over a shell, so chain 5, 3, 4 and 5, turn our work around and we will single crochet into the last shell we made, that chain 1, cut your thread and can finish our work ok so this is our first pineapple we'll 
series where we started it with this uh, slip stitch uh, slip stitches across and uh, so we need to turn our work around and we will work into the next pineapple this is the one we finished and we will go to the next so on the left side we will do a slip slip knot and attach our thread into the next shell so let's do a slip stitch that chain three and we'll do a shell over a shell chain four and single crochet into the next chain three loop of our pineapple so each uh, pineapple you will finish the same way when you you will work across and so let's do this one together Here we are at the last chain 3 loop, single crochet in it and chain 4 and we will do a shell over a shell so this is our edge and before we did here a uh, chain one and now we'll do a chain four and we'll finish uh, this pineapple as we did the first one so chain five turn our work shell in a shell chain 4 and single crochet into the first chain 3 loop of our pineapple chain 3 and single crochet into the next and so on so repeat each uh, one of these uh, pineapples and I will meet you when we will have done all 16 of them so uh, then we will do the edging around uh, our table claw and the next pineapple here we have our first one this is the second that we are doing on at the moment and the next one will be this one on the left so you will attach threads here do a shell over a shell chain four and then single crochet into the first chain three loop chain three and single crochet into the next when you will come across you will do a chain four shell over a shell chain five turn your work and work on the opposite side okay we are done with all of our pineapples and all we need to do is two more rows of the edge around uh, our table cloth or our square doily and we will do a slip knot and we will attach our thread into the chain one space here let's make a slip stitch on 
Now we'll chain one and single crochet into the same space. Chain two, one and two, and into the next chain five space we will do a shell. So two double crochets, chain two, and two more double crochets, in all into the chain five space. Chain two and shell into the next chain five space. chain two and again into the next chain five space we will make a shell. Chain two and shell into the next chain five space. So what we will do in all chain file spaces of this pineapple we will do a shell and chain to between so it will be 13 shells in this pineapple chain two. Chain two again. Here is our here is our next chain five space. We will do a shell into this space. As you can see, I didn't uh, hide the details before uh, because uh, you will have a little more. Uh, place to hide these uh, tails after we done this round <coughs> of shells. So chain two, and we'll go into the next chain five space and put a shell there. So Again and shell into the next chain five space. So, we did our first, uh, first part of our aging around this pineapple. Here we are at the last uh, chain 5 space. Now we will chain 2 and we will single crochet into the chain 1 space between these uh, pineapples. Here. Chain 
chain two and again we will work a shell into the next chain five space. Chain two into the next chain five space we will do a shell. Chain two and into the next chain five space, make a shell. So you will repeat this pattern around for the, this uh, first round of our edge. So into every chain five space, you will do a shell here, 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 here. here around and chain two between here is our last chain five space of this pineapple we will do a shell into this chain five space then chain two and single crochet into the chain one space between pineapples chain two again and into the next chain five space make a shell chain two a shell into shell, chain to shell and so on and I will meet you at the end of this round ok here we are at the end of this round we have our chain 2 and we will slip stitch into the first single crochet that we made now we will start our last round so we have to slip stitch uh, we have to come to this uh, shell and we will slip stitch into the next two chains into the next two double crochets and into the uh, into our shell like that. now we will chain 6 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6 and we will single crochet into the space in chain 2 space between the shells single crochet chain 3 and into the next shell we will do a double crochet chain 5, 2, 3, 4, 5 and into the double crochet we will do a single crochet to form a chain 5 pico and into the same space we will do one more double crochet chain 3 and single crochet into the chain 2 space between the shells chain 3 and again into the next shell we'll do a double crochet chain 5, 3, 4 and 5 single crochet into the double crochet and into the same space one more double crochet chain 3, single crochet into the chain 2 space between the shells, chain 3 and <coughs> into the next shell we will do double crochet, chain 5, single crochet into the double crochet uh, to form a chain 5 pico and into the same shell we will do one more double crochet then chain 3, uh, single crochet into the chain 2 space between the shells, chain 3 into the next shell we will do double crochet, chain 5 pico and one more double crochet that is how it looks like and continue this pattern around this uh, pineapple and 
I'll meet you when you come here to show you how to, what to do next. So <clears throat> you will do a double double crochet. Chain five, single crochet into the double crochet to form this picot. We will come around this uh, pineapple. We we'll single crochet into the chain to space between the shells. Chain three. Here is our last shell of this pineapple. We will do a double crochet. Chain five, three, four, five, single crochet into the double. Into the double crochet. Yeah. And now we'll do a double crochet into the next shell. Chain three, then single crochet into the chain the space between the shells. Chain three, and again we will do a double crochet, chain five pico, and a double crochet into the next shell. Chain three, single crochet into the chain the space between the shells, and so on. And we will repeat this pattern around. So when we come into this area here. We will into the last shell of this uh, pineapple. We will do a double crochet, then chain five, single crochet into the double crochet to form a pico, and we will skip this uh, space here and go straight into the next shell and do a double crochet there. So, and we will have this form. So, into this shell. Double crochet, chain five pico, and double crochet into the next shell, and then continue as before. Round around, and I'll meet you at the last uh, shell that uh, we will finish this tablecloth together. Here we have to do one more uh, single crochet into chain two space between the shells, chain three, double crochet into the next shell, chain five, single crochet into the double crochet, and now all we need to do a slip stitch into the third chain of our starting chain six slip stitch chain one and you can cut our thread pull through and we're done So here's our project uh, finished. Now all we have to do is just hide all those tails. Then I uh, will probably just iron it, and so that it will be nice and. Even I think I won't uh, starch it uh, because I think it's so nice and even uh, without uh, starch. And so I will just iron it. Okay. So if you like this video, please subscribe. Uh, let me know in the comments below what you think. Uh, you can always visit my uh, 
website uh, crochetbypp.com and uh, there you can reach me with uh, uh, you can send me an email there so so if you like this video please uh, subscribe and uh, Uh, let me know if you started this project and finish it you can put it down in the comment so I would uh, love to know uh, how many of you uh, actually finished this piece so till next time